Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm Emily, the home bookkeeper, and on this channel, I help business owners and fellow freelance bookkeepers navigate the ever-changing QuickBooks Online, while also sharing insightful videos on all things business ownership and finance. As always, this is a sample company provided by QuickBooks for educational purposes only. In today's video, I am going to cover the accounts payable workflow in QuickBooks Online. This is the business owner view of QuickBooks Online for business owners. If you are a fellow home bookkeeper, feel free to check out my QuickBooks Online tutorials for bookkeepers playlist for a better view of what QuickBooks Online will look like for you. First things first, you'll want to head over to the white new button on top of the left hand side toolbar and under the vendors column, click on bill. This will open the new bill screen. Select the vendor you wish to bill from the vendor drop-down box. If the vendor was set up properly, all of the vendor details should automatically populate in the fields below. Now that you've selected your vendor, you can now set the bill terms, the bill date, and the due date. And scrolling down, enter in the category, description if you wish, and enter the amount of your bill. As you can see here, this is a common bill for this vendor. So QuickBooks Online remembered the data from the previous transactions and automatically filled it in when the vendor was chosen. All bills allow you to select if the bill is a billable expense, if there is tax that needs to be applied, and if the bill is connected to a customer or a specific project. You can also add in a memo note and attach documents like contracts, receipts, invoices, etc. In the center of the bottom toolbar, you can also select if this bill is something that is recurring. When finished, click the green save and close button. Now that the bill is entered into the system, you can once again click the white new button and under vendors, click pay bills. Now the bill will show up on the pay bill screen as unpaid. Selecting the bill we just created and confirming the accounts you wish the bill to be paid out of Click the green Schedule Payments Online button to use the new QuickBooks Online Bill Pay feature. This has made managing accounts payable so easy for me and my clients. Since this is a sample company, I can't show you the bill pay process, but it is very self-explanatory. Just simply follow the prompts and you've completed the entire bill pay workflow. For more business resources, my online self-paced home bookkeeper masterclass business supplies, gadgets, must-haves, and more, make sure to check out edjconsultinggroup.com backslash resources, linked below. And of course, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those bell notifications so you'll never miss an upload. If you have any video or tutorial requests, make sure to leave them in the comments below. And for even more behind-the-scenes content of life as a home bookkeeper, feel free to follow me on Instagram at Emma Dawn, and connect with me on LinkedIn. And if you need more assistance, private QuickBooks online coaching, or bookkeeping and payroll management, feel free to email or visit edjconsultinggroup.com. My firm is fully inclusive and ready to help you along wherever you may be in your entrepreneurship or personal wealth building journey.